All right, what's up, guys? It is Case Central here, and today I am bringing you some amazing, unexpected, and possibly potentially really exciting Kingdom Hearts news for you guys today. I'm uh, sorry, my voice may sound a little messed up. I was at a concert the other day, and my voice really hasn't healed yet. Um, so you know, whatever. We still got some amazing news to talk about, so let's just get into it. So it's been kind of slow over the past couple days in terms of Kingdom Hearts three news. Not really much, that much stuff to talk about. Um, and you know, it's just, I guess it's like after TGS, they wanted to calm down a little bit. Um, but today, apparently we just got a blowout of new stuff. We just got a bunch of new stuff today because today, um, Square Enix posted all over their Twitter and Facebook page and stuff like that. New renders of Kingdom Hearts 3, specifically Olympus Coliseum and Twilight Town. Now we actually kind of get teased on this, uh, stuff yesterday because there was like a preview of a V Jump magazine where they did show these screenshots, but I knew there was going to be more stuff coming, so I kind of saved it for that. Um, so today we just got a bunch of new stuff, so let's just go over the stuff that we saw. First, I'm going to go over the Olympus Coliseum screenshots that we got, because, dude, we got a lot of cool stuff in this one. It's the one that was kind of teased yesterday, but we got the full screenshots here, and dude, they're freaking awesome. Um, a couple we've already seen before, like where uh, Hercules is holding the rock above his head and uh, the Titans surrounding him. Um, but we got a bunch of other ones as well, like we get our first look at Zeus. Um, here he is uh, looking at Hercules right here, which is freaking cool. Um, we get our first look at Meg and Pegasus and Phil all in one screenshot um, where they're sitting on Pegasus going on somewhere. Um, and it's just a bunch of other ones as well, like we get to see a lot of Hades in here, um, even one where he's on his throne, which is really freaking cool, he looks badass on there, um, and a lot of Hercules as well, and just what his render looks like in there, and just, dude, these screenshots are, like, absolutely gorgeous, man, like, absolutely freaking gorgeous, um, I am so excited to see that the game looks this good, what they're getting out of the Emerald Legend 4 is, well, unreal, you know, pun intended, um, and just, man, this game is looking better by the day, these are, like, the best looking screenshots that we've gotten so far, for the game. I am so excited that it looks this good. It's so much of an improvement of what they've been showing in the past. And it shows how much attention to detail they're putting in this game, man. And it's just amazing. And, of course, we actually get full renders of the characters in here. Like, we get Zeus, Hades, um, Hercules, Pegasus, Phil, all those people. And their renders look amazing as well. It's just beautiful. And the second set of screenshots that we got today for the game was of Twilight Town and renders of the Twilight Town gang, Hater, Pins, and Olette. Um, so it was a lot of stuff we've kind of seen before in past trailers, um, just a couple more extra shots from it, like we get to see some more shots of the computer room and um, Ienzo working his little magic in there, and Pence kind of working out the computer as well, and also them running away from the Heartless, which we've seen before, um, and just one big screenshot of all of them, um, Sword Doll and Goofy, Hainer, Pence, and Olette, um, standing in front of the mansion, so it seems like they're going to be playing a big part in this game, which I think is really interesting, and of course we get full renders of Painter, Pins, and Olet as well, which absolutely look absolutely beautiful. I mean, everything about these screenshots are just absolutely beautiful, man. I am so excited for this fucking game, man. And that's pretty much it in terms of screenshots that we got today. On um, there, maybe more coming out tomorrow. Who knows? Um, but these screenshots are absolutely amazing, man. Oh my god, it just shows how much attention to detail they're putting in this game, man. Because these screenshots, they're um, immaculate. I'll just gonna say big words here, immaculate, because. They're just that good looking, man. I am so excited to see that this game is looking this good. And I can't wait to actually play it on my fucking PS4, man. Oh my god, it's gonna look so amazing. And also, since they are releasing a lot of stuff today, um, a lot more than they were kind of doing in the past, like, week or something like that, it seems like they're ramping up for something. I don't know what. Um, it, but it seems like they are kind of ramping up for some reveal or new thing coming out in the, like the next week or something like that like a new trailer new gameplay whatever it may be it seems like they're ramping up for something so that's really exciting too and just yo i i am so excited that they put these things out man like i said before because they just look so freaking good you know i'm religion 4 is a fucking beast and this game really does show it it really is an engine that you can just do a lot with and they managed to pull this off man they managed to pull this shit off, and I am so fucking proud of them. Oh my god. Um, again, it doesn't say which um, system the screenshots are being taken on, so it, I guess that could be up to interpretation as well. Um, it, may, it may not actually look like that in-game because, you know, of the motion blur and stuff like that. They probably just got, like, one single frame of a cutscene and just kind of took a picture of that and just got all the details in there, right? But, you know, who cares? It still looks amazing regardless. Um, so, I'm really excited that they put this out. I'm really excited for this fucking game, of course. Why wouldn't I be? Um, and, you know, it's coming up. It's coming up slowly. 
Man, the release date is almost upon us. January 29th, 2019 is going to be an amazing day um, for me. I'm not going to play the Japanese version. I'm just going to wait till the English version comes out. I'm probably going to be going offline for a couple days because I don't want to get spoiled for the game. You know what I mean? Um, so, you know, we are going to have some fun times. January 29th. It's gonna be a fucking amazing day. So that's all I want to talk about with you guys in this video. Tell me down in comments below what you think about these screenshots. Are you excited that they put these out? Are you ready for this fucking game? Because I don't even know if I am. Um, and you know, just what do you think they're gonna be doing in the next week? Do you think they are ramping up for something with all these screenshots coming out? Tell me down in the comments below your opinion. Also, make sure to subscribe and like this video. It'd be really awesome if you did. This has been Case Central, and I will see you guys later. Bye.